Hi everybody, it's Honest John again. Now you all might remember a little place called Flint, Michigan. The place where the Republican governor and the Republican legislature put under an emergency manager and he screwed up the entire water system. So the people of Flint can't drink the water that comes out of their tap. Well, you would think that a crisis like this would get immediate action, but the governor and the legislature of France, uh, the legislature of Michigan, have been dragging their feet to try to, uh, as far as doing anything to help Flint. So, uh, Democrats in the Senate managed to get a bill passed that passed with bi bipartisan support. Uh, 93 votes for uh, to to help out Flint, to help to help them get their water water back in in shape, so that the residents can go back to some semblance of normal living. It passed the Senate by that much, but uh, the House, Paul Ryan hasn't brought that bill up to the floor. It's just sitting there. Uh, so, out of desperation, the Democrats in the Senate uh, made an amendment to the uh, continuing resolution to keep the government funded that would uh, have had money in it to, to help out Flint. Uh, and that passed. But for some reason or another, when Mitch McConnell submitted that bill to the House, uh, that amendment was missing. And of course, the Republicans in the House aren't going to do anything about it. So, I mean, this is unprecedented. There has never been a situation like this uh, where uh, a, a community, a town, a city in the United States in a crisis like this one has just been left to uh, fester. Well, except for maybe when uh, New Orleans got hit by Hurricane uh, Katrina, and George Bush just let that go for as long as he could. So, what's the problem? Well, maybe the problem is is that Flint is a majority black city. And Republicans are the party of racism. That's the only explanation that I can think of. Thanks for listening.